Is it disrespectful to accept a job offer whilst at second stage interview with another company? As someone who works in HR, I can assure you that it wasn't disrespectful or unprofessional at all. The recruiter is just being a dick. Nope. You are good. 100%. Any good recruiter would already assume you are looking elsewhere, but should ask you anyway. And you should answer honestly. Also, since it sounds like the other job was better suited for you, you are actually doing them a favor and not wasting their time by not going to an interview for a job you'll never take. The only thing you can do in this scenario that would leave even a whiff of being unprofessional is if you just ghosted them. The recruiter was wrong. Everyone knows applicants want the best job as soon as possible. And you are talking to multiple companies at once. They had not made an offer yet. Was he expecting you to sit around not making any money while they mulled it over? He was the unprofessional one. And the proof is that you will probably hesitate to apply there again. In other words, he failed to stay on good terms with a talented applicant. He's a bad recruiter. You don't need to justify it to him beyond saying you accepted an offer with another company and won't be continuing the interview process. No, the recruiter is just unhappy that he has to do his job and look for more candidates. You are free to accept a job offer anytime. Recruiter is pissed he or she missed a commission. Plain and simple. And now they will have to find other candidates. The recruiter was very disrespectful and unprofessional for not respecting your career decisions. And for blocking you afterwards. He just burned a bridge for such a stupid reason. If you want to be petty about it, you could email the company the recruiter wanted you to go for and mention that the recruiter seemed quite insulted and blocked you. So you hope there are no hard feelings between you and the company. Not at all. This happens all the time. No, that's not disrespectful. At least you took the time to tell the recruiter. Most PPL would just ghost them. His problem, not yours. Unless you have some future desire to work at that company. Even then, that would only be a problem if he is still working there and remembers you. At the moment he is possibly salty because you were probably close to getting an offer and he may be under pressure to fill the position you were interviewing for. Most companies won't tell you if there are other candidates competing for a position they are looking at you for, at best. You can get a timeline for when you can expect a decision one way or the other. Bottom line. Someone who. You do not know personally. Who is not in a position to harm you professionally. Who you will very probably never have any kind of communication with again in your life. Is angry at you right now. There is no rational reason why any of this matters. End communication. All may possibly be fair in love and war, but when it comes to putting food on the table there is absolutely no loyalty required or assumptions that should be made until you agree to an offer. No not at all. No, when I was at a corp we had people start and a week later leave because one of the other companies hired them with a better offer. There's number one in this game and it's you. Do they give a f about you? You're replaceable. No. Nah, you're fine. Congrats smiley face. Kind of disrespectful for a recruiter to get mad because their client got the job that they wanted. Would it be disrespectful for company to hire someone who is more qualified than you? Perfectly fine. At no point throughout the process disrespectful. The process is for both parties to get to know each other after all if it's a good match. Beside I assume they are talking to other candidates as well. So why shouldn't you be able to talk to other companies? 
Take the job you were offered. Make yourself happy. That other company will recover and hire someone who might be better suit 3 ed. I see it as respectful and professional to not waste the interviewer's time if you don't plan on taking the job. I don't think so. The recruiter sounds extremely unprofessional. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Aircast is like doom scrolling through your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.